Guess who has a juicy story to tell? Hello there. Um, we need to talk about something that happened yesterday. Okay, so if you've been subscribed for over one year, you'll know that I'm, I'm a pole dancer. That's my hobby and that's what I like doing. Um, my old pole dancing studio contacted me yesterday and they said on Friday they're having a photo shoot and they want me to be a model again. Because if you know last year, I, I did a photo shoot last year for Day of the Dead, but this time it's going to be anything you want. They're, they're letting me pick out which costume I want and who I want to be, and they're just going to take pictures of me. I know you're wondering, Jenny, how could you be a model with those really bad looking, um, yeah, you know, chapped lips, crooked teeth? Well, at the photo shoot, whenever I have a photo shoot, I usually don't smile big, even though they tell me to. They're always like, smile big, and I probably give them like a slight smile, like, hmm, I am going to be a model again, woo! Last year, I went with teased hair. It was just, I feel like my hair could have done better. So, any makeup artist out there, I know I have a lot of makeup gurus watching my vlogs. If you have a hair tutorial on Day of the Dead, then that would be great. I know how to do the makeup because last year I did the makeup. Well, I didn't do the makeup. I, I painted my face white. You guys saw. And I keep wanting to say the last vlog, but this was over a year ago. Um, I painted my face white and this uh, makeup girl did the rest, like all the details. So yeah, it's going to be on Friday. So unfortunately, I don't have time to pick out another costume. Uh, I wish they told me two weeks before this happened, but no, they actually told me yesterday and I only have like, what, three, three or four more days to get ready? Okay, so I actually found the photos from last year. This is my sister. She's not going this year because she says it's too long of a wait and it's boring, but this time they informed me that there's going to be food and water. So that's my sister. This is moi. I'm going to be wearing the same outfit. It's in my closet, actually. Um, don't worry, there's no people behind me. If you watch that vlog, you'll know that it's just a backdrop. Look at my hair, though. See, I went... It was kind of teased, and it wasn't neat, because in my head, I was just like, it doesn't need to be neat, because I'm playing someone dead. So, that was my thinking process, but now I want to do something different. I don't know what kind of camera angle that was. I was, like, <laughs> holding it really bad. But anyways, see... Even though I'm really ugly, I can still be a good model. Moral of the day, you do not need street, street, straight teeth and a perfect face to model. So yeah, they basically just Photoshop a lot. I just remembered something about pole dancing. I said I would get back into it on New Year's Day because that was my New Year's resolution. But it's so freaking expensive like classes are like a hundred dollars each month which is the type of money we don't have and if we do have that type of money we spend it on food and the rent and whatnot and to buy a pole a good pole is three hundred dollars so it's really hard when you have an expensive hobby but anyways um i'm still trying to get back into pole dancing and i'm saving up to get a pole but it's taken a really long time by the way guys frosty got a haircut frosty frosty look at us frosty 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 hey frosty you got something on your mouth Ugh. to the winners of the giveaway i sent out your prizes like yesterday no the day before and uh yeah, hopefully you guys will get them soon. I know you guys live very, very far away. And unfortunately, it might take a month. Because I know I've sent many letters to Minnesota. So I have I know that a letter from California to Minnesota takes exactly one month. And some of you guys live farther than Minnesota. So don't be surprised or scared or betrayed. Don't feel those that way if you don't get your letter in like one month because it takes forever so yeah don't be don't be scared if it takes like two months or something the thing with giveaways is that i do want to give away more things and i do want to give you guys 
as much prizes as possible. But I'm so poor. How can I give away prizes when I can't even buy off of McDonald's $1 menu? I've spent like about two or three hours looking up websites where I can sell my art and where people will actually buy it. I tried Etsy, but with Etsy you need a bank account and I only have PayPal. So my friends told me of eBay, which only accepts PayPal. So I check out eBay. eBay says my PayPal doesn't work and I went on my PayPal and it does work. So something's wrong with eBay, it won't accept my PayPal. So I tried Amazon, but I'm not sure about Amazon because it's not telling me and I don't want to sign up to Amazon to like find out whether I need a bank account or a PayPal. And I tried Store Envy, but I'm pretty sure with Store Envy you need a bank account too. So I'm screwed and I'm, I'm just looking up art websites or any type of website where I can sell my art. So if you guys have any suggestions, please, please, please tell me because my PayPal is working, but eBay is acting up, so. I'm just gonna go now, chillax, and edit this vlog because I have another video I, I wanna edit, so I'm just gonna get to that. So see you guys in the course of 48 hours.